Hey everyone, it's Feral here with a really, really fast, quickie guide to how I personally farm Annex. Since September 16th, 2017, from the day I got my first Annex, I have seen about 60 Annexes doing this method with a little bit of variance to make it more streamlined. So let's just get right into it. First thing you're going to do is make a class trial. I have a more in-depth guide on how I use class trials to farm rare spawns, but for this I'm going to go through it quickly. I use druids because they're just kind of streamlined, really easy to move around in, kind of small on the screen, but it's up to you what you want to make. Just make a class trial on a low population roleplay realm if you decide to use a roleplay realm. I choose roleplay realms because they do not have cross realm zoning. Do keep in mind that you can only make four class trials an hour, I believe is the limit. I think you can make eight a week, and you can own twelve total. Trials last eight played hours, you can check your time by typing slash played. Once you log in, you're going to be prompted to do the class trial scenario, but you can just hearth out of this, like you saw me just do. Once you're out, you can just fly to deep and the portal will be unlocked for you. First thing you're going to want to do is make a slash target macro. Slash target annex is what I roll with. Um, you can also do Bloodseeker too, but the chances of you seeing Bloodseeker is insanely slim, but I have him anyway just in case. You can also use the add on Silver Dragon, which will aid you with uh, targeting annex. It'll put a little like, set focus on him or something. Um, I think Silver Dragon's a little overkill for me, so I just run with the target macro, but it's up to you. Also, what you saw me just do there, the little circle around the inner ring, was the entire Anax check. When you have the target macro set up, you can target them from the inside of the temple from pretty much every direction. So all you have to do, once you have your character in deep home, uh, is just fly in a little circle on the inside. You don't have to fly out or anything to target him. Uh, I've been able to target every single Anax from the inside of the temple. I fly out a little bit there, it's kind of overkill, but I just don't really want to miss that one but I have targeted every single Anax just in this little rotation here. So you reduce your time significantly by doing this. And you can log out instantly on Roleplay Realms, but uh, on Roleplay PvP and PvP Realms, you are not able to log out instantly, but that's just another thing. As for some information about Anax, his spawn timer is likely to be 2 to 8 hours, but there's a chance that it's 3 to 12. It's kind of hard to pinpoint when you're not constantly camping him, because all I do is this class trial method on like 8 realms or something. Bloodseeker will spawn 15 out of 16 times. 1 out of 16 times it will be Anax. Anax is up infinitely when he spawns until he is mounted or the servers restart. Bloodseeker, however, is up for something like 5 to 15 seconds before he despawns and Anax's timer restarts from 2 hours or 3 hours. That is being the minimum. There you go! There's my quick guide on how to farm Anax. Good luck out there and hopefully you can get your own soon!